In short, you get a bunch of parts for the top end of the engine, new cylinder heads, and forged pistons, as well as a full Akrapovic race exhaust system and a flash TCU. The end result is 215 claimed horsepower from the 65 degree V4 and what I can only assume is a noise from the end of the pipe that would make Satan's pit bull wee on the carpet. The other way to add horsepower, just like your trainer keeps saying, is to lose weight. This factory works kit also includes a lithium battery, machined aluminum upper triple clamp, a different fuel cell, all new bodywork and a bunch of carbon bits that shed around 22 pounds off the stock RS V4. To be fair, a stock RS V4 isn't crazy light, so losing 10 kilos was on the to-do list anyway. Mirror block off plates help complete the race look and shave a little weight by kicking off the stalks, too. Last, and most definitely not least, are your very own winglets, pulling from MotoGP knowledge learned by Aprilia's RSGP effort. The aerodynamic appendages are said to improve aero. But honestly, that not why you want them. Is it? No. Same as the upper triple clamp and carbon pieces, this is all about looking the part. Like I said, a stock RS V4 is more motorcycle than most people are ready for anyway, and the reason this kit is cool is because it gives out more of what we don't have the gall to use. No word on pricing, but it's probably cheaper than the 160,000 euro price tag of a full Z RS.